Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the Pokemon White Nuzlocke. Uh, we're in the Pokemon Center. Last episode, we... We made it to... Fuck, what's this city called again? Now I need to know, I forgot. Trainer Tips, I was trying to find out what the city was called. Oh, Pellucid, I just remembered. I'm a fucking idiot, guys. Anyway, last episode, we made it here. There was a Getsis speech. We caught a Rufflet. A lot of cool shit, but we're supposed to go here now. Just a little farther. Okay. This is Drayden's house, right? Drayden's house. Yep. I was right. This is it. Alright, so we're gonna hear a long-ass fucking story today. Y'all excited? This is a nice-ass fucking house, though. I'll explain. What you are holding is the Dark Stone. Zekrom will likely awaken from the Dark Stone, and Reshiram, who is already awake, were once the same Pokemon. That single dragon Pokemon, along with twin heroes, brought a new region into being, and people and Pokemon had happy lives. One day, however, the twin heroes, the older brother who sought the truth, and the younger brother who sought ideals, began to argue about how to decide which one of them was right. The single dragon type Pokemon that had been with them all that time split its body into two. One sided with the older brother and the other sided with the younger brother. In its pursuit of truth, the white dragon type Pokemon sought to usher in a new and better world. Its name was Reshiram. And the other, the black dragon type Pokemon sought ideals and to usher in a new world, a world of hope. Its name was Zekrom. Because the two of them were once the same entity, their battle raged endlessly, and neither one could be declared the winner. They simply exhausted themselves. The twin heroes proclaimed that there was one that there was no one side that was right, and seized the conflict. But but the two heroes' sons started the battle again, and an instant later Reshiram and Zekrom destroyed Unova with fire and lightning. Then they disappeared. But but if people work with Pokemon in the right way, we don't have to worry anymore about the world being destroyed. I mean, Reshiram and Zekrom worked hard for everyone and made a new region. So it should be all right, I think. True, Pokemon cannot speak. People may hurt Pokemon even more by imposing their selfish thoughts on them. But no matter what, Pokemon and people believe in each other, need each other, and will continue to live together. Yeah. So I'm never going to forgive Team Plasma for trying to separate Pokemon and us. Sorry, we got a little off topic at the end. That is everything we know. Unfortunately, we don't know how to make, how to wake up the legendary Pokemon. I made a promise to Alder. You must win the gym badge from the Opelucid Pokemon Gym. Iris, you go and be Razor's opponent at the Pokemon Gym. Yay, look out. I'm really, really strong, just like Drayden. All right, you don't have anything to say to me? What will it accomplish to separate the worlds of people and Pokemon? The way we live now with different beings understanding and forgiving each other is much richer. That's my belief. All right, I guess we'll take down the gym this episode. Ooh, who's up here? Is this your family? I'm coaching Iris. Concerned about your Pokemon's weight. Ooh, a float stone, that's pretty cool. Thank you, dude. Alright, I guess we'll uh, take on the gym, unless you have something to tell me. You have an item? Maybe it'll master it. Here it is. Ring target. Okay. Thanks. If Pokemon holds a ring target, it can be hit by a move that would, would usually have no effect. Okay. Thanks. Alright, time to take down the gym. Uh, I don't know. I don't think I've shown you guys my team this episode. It's still the same as last episode, so no worries. Um, I would have leveled up Lego. But I don't see a point right now since we're going to be taking on a dragon gym. And I know Lego, you know, is super effective on other dragons with his dragon attacks. But if he gets hit by a dragon move, it's fucking over for him. He's gone. So we're not going to be leveling up and even using him in this gym. Yo, what's up, home? Oh, shit. Yo, let me talk to him, dude. Welcome to Opelousa Gym. The Univa region's strongest and biggest trial. First off, please take this fresh water. It'll help you in the challenge ahead. Dude, he's always hooking me up. His name is Clyde, right? I remember right? It's not gonna tell me. Let me give you a brief explanation of the trick to the Opelucid Gym. The path around this gym is shaped like two dragons. This path changes when you step on the switches on the dragon's arms. Pay attention to how the dragon's next move. Alright. 
Wait, what's this? I don't know what that is. Uh, who's leading? Wanted to get Cherry. Yeah, yeah, Cherry is indeed leading. I need to get her some levels, man. Okay, you are gonna fight me. Awesome. I'm expecting to uh, see Drudigan, Axu Fracture, and Haxorus. Maybe there's even like um, Zuelos, uh, Hydreigon, and Dino in this gym. I mean, those are the only Unova Dragon types in the game, so. Those are the ones I am expecting. Alright. Uh, let's just go for Crunch. Fracture is a pure dragon type. Okay, nice damage. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Anyway, I don't think he's going to be able to kill Cherry anyway. I got some stuff to talk about. I always do. I first want to see how much this does, though. All right, that doesn't do too much, good. So I'm recording this video on a Sunday that I was turnip day on Animal Crossing. So I did a little thing, right? I had a, I had a million in bells and I was like, all right, it's, it's like, it was like 10 or 11. I'm gonna buy a million worth of turnips and then I'm gonna go to people who are selling them from a, for a decent price, right? So I sold my million for like, 170 no no wait i sold my million worth of turnips for a million 750 so i made 175 percent profit right and then i took that 1.75 uh, million i'm so bad at explaining i just realized that and i took that and i bought new turnips with that and then I went to someone's island who was selling it for 300 per turnip. So I made... I made a lot of money, guys. I had like 6 million at the end in, in, my, in my bank. And um, paid off my final home loan. So I don't own Tom Nook anything. And I still got 300... By th three, 3 million and 500,000 left in the bank. Oh my god, I suck at explaining. Also, it's uh, C. Doc Community Day on Pokemon Go, if you guys are into that stuff. I, I played a little bit before I started recording, and I caught about maybe 30, 30 C. Dot. I um, didn't get the shiny, though. I still gotta get the shiny. It runs till, like, 5 p.m., though, so I got more than enough time. So, yeah, I'll definitely catch it. What the fuck, Dano? Stop! Oh, this small fuck is gonna kill Cherry, dude. I have to heal. I have to. I did buy new potions. I uh, I saw that I had a lot of money. Money. I money. Why do I? Do? What does that sound weird? I don't know. I'm tripping today. I had a lot of money. That's gonna hurt. So I bought Ultra Balls. Okay. Ooh, I gotta switch. I mean, mm, it, it's not gonna change anything, right? I need something that could take a hit. Mm, let's send out my legendary dude. Send out my legendary. He's a dark type. So this will this will be a good matchup. Anyway, yeah, I bought Ultra Balls, I bought Hyper Potions, Max Potions. You avoided it. Good job, dude. And I bought Max Repels. And some full heals. That's all I bought. Anyway, we got the Dano down. Hell yeah, baby. Maybe I should just lead with a uh, Stabby, even though he's hella overleveled compared to my other squad members. I do want to heal up Cherry. Where the fuck are my potions? Uh, where's my hyper potions? Dude, am I blind? Oh no, am I... Okay, I got it. I'm not that blind. Alright, there we go, baby. Wait, do I go up here? What's this? It's just... Isn't anything? Okay. Alright, we're gonna go down here and then... What the fuck? How does that help me? Oh, so now we can go up there. Okay, I see. I see. And then there should be a trainer here. There's a trainer here, yep. Well, Cherry's healed, so we should be fine. Alright, I want to talk about some more Animal Crossing with y'all. Because I got another story. So I've been using this um, this website, right? Nookazon. 
It's like Amazon, but it's for all things uh, Animal Crossing, right? So I've been going crazy with buying DIY recipes. I've bought like maybe 40 DIY recipes on Nukazan, and I'm trying to I'm trying to get not all of them, but I am trying to work up a decent uh, library of DIYs because I've been decorating a lot. I built a restaurant yesterday and having all these DIYs is just so useful for decorating. I think Cherry will be fine here. Honestly, this is fine. Is it? Because he is raising his speed, which is kind of scary. Because no, he's going to be able to get one hit off, but that shouldn't kill as long as he doesn't get a crit. I think we're fine. That shouldn't kill. Unless it crits. Okay, didn't crit. We're good. This gym is a little scary because this is like um, one of those times where I'm not crazily overleveled. Because I don't know if y'all remember. At one point of the game, I had to kind of overlevel. Because um, I only had a few Pokemon. And I, I, was, uh, I was really scared of some rival battles coming up. So... I decided I needed to overlevel a little bit, and ever since then, I've been, like, a few levels overleveled. But now we're finally, like, back on track. I feel like we're the same level as everyone else. Uh, let's go for Discharge. That's some nice stab, some high damage. Guys, Blobfish has honestly surprised me. I never really looked at Stunfisk like a Pokemon that's really, like, great. But, okay, well, he didn't do that much damage. But we did get the Para. There we go. That's what I wanted. I wanted to get the para, and now we just mud bomb. Because we want to get that stab. If you don't know what stab is, same type attack bonus. Same type, same same type attack bonus. Yeah, I am right. What the fuck am I thinking? You shouldn't be able to kill Blob. Should be fine here. He avoided it. And he wasn't able to move either, so... We both didn't get to have our turn... Lit. That's gonna level us up, baby. Ooh, that's a lot of experience. Yo, guys, by the way, I want to just talk about some IRL shit real quick. Uh, guys, I, like, quit school, right? Like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't got a clue. But anyway, I quit. And over here, you pretty much just get paid to go to school. You get, like, a certain amount of money depending on your living situation. And I quit. And these motherfuckers are still paying me, so I don't know what the fuck they're doing, but I'm getting free money over here, so I am not complaining. I got a lot of money saved up in my bank right now. A lot. That's not a flex, by the way. That's literally just the truth. I have so much fucking money, and I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Probably just going to save it. Probably. Wait, fuck. I didn't heal up Cherry. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I don't think I healed her up, right? Yikes. Okay, we're lowering Fracture's attack, though. That's very good. Wait. Wait, what? Oh, okay, so... It showed Intimidate, and then it showed Mold Breaker. So I thought the Intimidate went through. But if you guys don't know, Mold Breaker is just an ability that stops your ability from working. So I was like, why the fuck did he even show Intimidate if he has Mold Breaker? But nah, that makes sense. Just to show that I canceled it out. Stop dragon dancing. Why is every Pokemon in this gym trying to set up on me? Alright, hit him with... I don't know if Sacred Sword or Iron Head is a better move here. I think I'm just going to go for Sacred Sword because I think it's a higher amount of damage. That did a lot. Alright, he's probably going to outspeed me now, though, with uh, two dragon dances up. Shouldn't be able to kill me, though. Should not be able to kill me. Why would you go for Taunt? Imagine going for two Dragon Dances and then trying to go for Taunt. Like, I'm going to use some type of healing move or some shit or growl. God, get the fuck out of here, Fracture. You're an embarrassment, my man. How are you an ace trainer? You suck at Pokemon, dude. <laughs> fuck you, Clara. All right, I got to heal up Cherry, though. Let me not forget. I'm not going to forget. But there you go. All right. Is that the last trainer? It might be. Uh, maybe like one more, actually. Yeah, we're going to go down here. It's going to move us to the right. Wait. 
Was that the last one? Is that gonna go up now? Or do we, we probably gotta press one more button and the head will go up. This button? No. I don't think I gotta go up here though. Okay. We're gonna go this way. You're not a trainer, are you? No, you are. Why, why did you like, he was standing in a weird way. I, I don't know how to explain it. That was weird. He didn't look like someone who would uh, fight me. Veteran Hugo. Ooh, finally a Drudigan, huh? That's awesome. Level 42, though, that's a little scary. Ooh, do we set up with Cherry for once? I, I rarely set up with uh, with Cherry. I do have Workup, and I never use it. All right, let's go for it. Let's hope this Drudigan uh, tries setting up as well. What's he gonna go for? Revenge. Oh, that's bad, that's a fighting move. Oh, come on. Tank it, tank it. Tank it, tank it. Oh my god, didn't do that much. <laughs> Yo, this is great though. If it doesn't do that much, we have a free setup right here. Because we could just heal spam and uh, work up. Alright, why do you go for Dragon Call? You have a super effective move on me. Kind of seems dumb. I mean, it did about the same damage, I'd say. Alright, now we heal up. We're plus two. We're plus two, attack. All right, he doesn't... I, I just need him to not crit. If he crits, this strategy might be fucking over and Cherry dies. All right, now you need to go for one more workup. This is the last workup I'm going for. And then we're gonna go ham. Okay, don't crit me. If you crit me, uh, Cherry might be dead. Don't crit, don't crit. Okay, good. Yes, dude. I love it when I don't get critted. All right, watch him miss his move right here. That would be lovely. That would be absolutely lovely. He doesn't miss. This is, doesn't do too much. Okay, and now we ruin your day. Hit him with a crunch, baby. That's gonna do a lot, a lot, dude. Honestly, for Cherry, I, I, I feel like that's a lot of damage. Don't crit, don't crit, don't fucking crit. Don't crit. Okay. I'm getting so lucky, guys. One crit and, and Cherry's gone. It's so scary, dude. Oh my god. All right. Crit here doesn't matter. Just means I gotta spend an extra turn healing. All right, no crit. Beautiful. All right, hit him with the crunch. Finish him off. Did he only have a again? Rough skin doesn't matter. We already got you, bud. We already got you. Hmm. 2200 experience? Okay. Reversal. That does like, what, 60 damage? No. It's an all-out attack that become more powerful the less HP the user has. Hmm. That would be... Eh, mm, nah, I'm good. I don't think I want that at all. Fuck you, Hugo. That should be the last trainer. We fought like four already. All right, let's heal up Cherry. Um, I don't think I'm gonna lead with her though. Cause like, she is okay. She's not that good, but I wanna lead with something strong. Like Horny. Horny is a good lead. And the reason is he has Pin Missile. And if the gym leader has like a Zuelos, a Dino, or a Hydragon, I can easily kill it with Pin Missile, because of the Dark Typing. So that's why I'm going to lead with him. That's the final one, right? Is it? No, that's not the final one. What the fuck? How many trainers are in this fucking gym? Jeez. Alright. Please tell me there's not another trainer here. But I see someone down there. Surely we got to fight that guy. Hey... Yeah, we gotta fight him. Fuck it, I'll lead with uh, Ferrothorn. I doubt Ferrothorn is uh, gonna die to this guy. Ferrothorn is very tanky. Should be able to take this easy. You have three Pokemon? Hey! Hey! This motherfucker led with something that I can easily kill, baby. Pharaoh, you should be able to kill this in one hit. 
Go ahead, do your thing, baby. Yeah, you're a fucking idiot for going for work up, dude. It's not gonna help you. It's not gonna help you at all. Let's see, how many pin missiles is it gonna take? All right, that's one. Okay, it actually doesn't do too much, but Ferrothorn's attack is not the greatest, so not too surprised. Should be dead here, though. Oh, that did nothing, buddy. You tried. Hit him with the iron barbs. Oh, he's dead. Pin and missile always hits uh, gu a guaranteed uh, two, so twice. So he's dead. Yo, give me, give me another one of those. Give me another Dano or a uh, Zwilus. Trudigan. Okay. Let's uh, let's use you. I haven't used Duck Lit in a while. All right, here we go. Hit him with Skull. Let's try to burn him. Let's try to give him that sweet old burn. Doesn't do much, but no burn either. You went for a fighting move on a flying tide? What the fuck is your problem? Are you fucking stupid? Still did a lot though. Kinda scary. Come on, burn him. Burn him, ducklet. Just hit him with it. Come on, dude. Don't crit. Don't fucking crit. Oh my god, that wasn't even a crit. I'm switching you out. You're fucking crazy. We're going in a stabby. Holy shit, fucking heart attack from that. Stabby, you should be able to take this, man. You're a legendary. You got this. Come on. Chip away. Doesn't that mean he switches out? Is that what chip away is? No, that's not what chip away is. I'm stupid. Alright, get him with sacred sword. Should do a decent amount. Oh, so close, man. So close. That you can eat that. Oh yeah. Mmm. What, what was that? Like four damage? Justified, baby! Yo, Justified finally coming in. I fuck with that. I think Justified, whenever um, whenever Stabby gets hit with a dark move, he gains, um, what's it, attack. That's what Justified is. I see it used a lot in, uh, in competitive. A lot of people use Justified. All right. Fracture. Let's go to Blob. I think Blob can handle Fracture. Wish I had... Um, Wish I had Stabby healed up, but it's whatever. Alright, do we paralyze you? Let's try again. Dude, really? You're gonna go for Taunt? Why does Fracture always go for Taunt? That doesn't help you. It doesn't help you at all. Come on. Paralyze, paralyze. Paralyze, paralyze. No! God damn it. One more try, and then we're gonna Mud Bomb spam. I don't want him to go fucking plus four and wreck my whole team. So don't take too long here, Bob. Paralyze. Paralyze, baby. Come on. Oh my god, a crit? Okay, well, let's go for another discharge then. You could you could tank that. Don't crit. Alright. Oh, hit him with the static, baby. We don't need it anymore, but that's still fucking sick. Alright, I think this is the last trainer wrapped up. I think we can fight Iris now. Fuck you, Ace Trainer, Tom. Fucking out here being the last trainer with three Pokemon. Are you crazy? What's your problem, man? What's your fucking problem? All right, let's heal up the boys. I mean, the girls. I literally have four girl Pokemon. One doesn't have a gender, and the other one's male. What the fuck? All right, there we go. We are going to lead with Horny, just in case he, uh, or she, leads with... Hydreigon, Dino, or Zoilus. This should be it, right? I swear to God, if I gotta fight another fucking dude, I'm gonna be pissed the fuck off. Wait, did I fight that girl yet? Hope the fuck I did. I really hope I did. Nah, I gotta fight that girl, don't I? Aw, oh, y'all are fucking killing me with this shit. Y'all are really killing me with this shit. Wait, where the fuck is this taking me then? How does that help me? What? Guys, am I stupid? Did I miss something while I was down there? <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, that's gonna reset what I just did. 
No, it raises the hand. I needed that, right? Did I? Yeah, I'm supposed to go here. Okay. Well, we gotta fight this bitch ass. If I haven't already fought her. Have I already fought her? Uh. Oh, fuck, dude. How many fucking trainers are in this bitch? God. Well, if you have three Pokemon, I'm literally gonna kill myself. Alright, two. Yes! Thank you for leading with Dano. Appreciate that. I really do. Hit him with the pin missile, baby! Oh, that's that's not gonna work out for you. Get it? Work up, work out for you? <laughs> I'm a comedian, by the way. I lied, I'm not. Not at all. Come on, hit him five times. Hit him five times with it. Oh, come on, two? Really? Horny, I trust in you, man. What are you doing, bud? That's not gonna do shit, man. 22 damage, look at you. Look at you, man. What are you lowering, my defense? Get hit with that iron barbs. Fuck out here, you're dead. Watch him live. Come on, okay. Nice, he got a crit. Good job, brother. All right, he has another one, right? Drudigan. I'll use Stabby. Stabby can handle this stuff. I know this motherfucker is gonna go for revenge, and it's gonna hurt a little. It might even get me close to to death, but it's okay. Is he gonna go for revenge? Ah, oh, rough skin, man. Shit. That's gonna hurt. I don't know if Stabby can live this, honestly. Okay! Okay, Stabby! I see you, man! Out here eating these powerful ass fucking hits, my dude. God damn. Now he should be able to handle this drug again easily. Night Slash? Really? I ain't gonna do shit. <laughs> wow, that really did nothing. Ooh, you popped my Justified. Night Slash is a dark move, you idiot. You fucking idiot. You're dead. Absolutely gone, dude. Absolutely gone. Yeah, get the fuck out of here with that rough skin, man. You're gone. Fuck off. Oh, you fight very well. You are great. Dude, stop sucking my dick, girl. God damn. God damn. Alright, I swear to God, if I gotta fight another dude, I'm gonna be pissed off. Please just take me to the gym leader. Alright. Is this gonna take me there? Nunny? I think I think we made it, guys. This looks like the biggest, baddest dragon. Wait, why the fuck are... Why is that dude standing there? What does he have to do with me? Get out of here. Another trainer. What the fuck, guys? You know what? This episode's been going on for almost 30 fucking minutes. Next episode, we're gonna beat that trainer. Maybe another fucking trainer after that. And then a gym leader. This is the cliffhanger episode I've never wanted. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's gonna be the end. I don't wanna make this episode an hour long. Um, I'll see y'all in the next one. Goodbye.